My name's Karis Kelly and I'm a UI designer. So UX and UI designers are um, obviously a design team. We design um, kind of how apps and websites look. It's not just about how it looks, it's all about how it works. So we're constantly thinking about our customers um, and you know how they'll use the app. It's got to be functional for them, um, but you know it does have to look nice as well. We mostly work on Sirius, a kind of platform we use in the call centres. So if you were phoning up Sky, um, the person on the other end of the phone will be using the Sirius on their laptop in order to kind of put through your order or check your account. We've worked with a lot of users um, that have got different needs, things like neurodiversity and visual impairments. And when I just started in the team, I got to work on looking at the kind of colour themes for the app. So from a design point of view, that was really cool. But in turn, it really benefited loads of users. So by changing it to darker colours, and allowing agents to kind of pick the colours that they use, um, it made it much more usable for them and much more enjoyable in their day-to-day. -day. For my role, it's because it's all about the users. One of my fears when I was younger is that I would be sitting in front of a, a computer every single day um, doing the same thing and it not really being about anything in particular. I want to do something that matters. And as much as I work in a job that's technical, and there's lots of kind of design considerations and there's all of that side, which I love. It all comes back to the people. It's all about what's important for the user and at the end of the day, what works for them. There's lots of chat about inclusivity, like all across the board. And then it's, I feel it's kind of becoming much more embedded within the teams as well. I've definitely found that through personal experience. Um, not long after I'd started at Sky, I was going through an ADHD diagnosis. The place I felt the most comfortable to be me and talk about it was actually work. And that's the complete opposite for most people. But my team were great. Like my boss had spoken about a family member that had been through the same process. And I felt so comfortable going to her and just saying, look, this is something that's going on in my life. And that was somebody that I could really trust. It's a very, very inclusive team. Thank you.